Got kind of a weird video to make here today. Um, uh, how to request from AU Fallout and more. About the length of these engines, which was the longest engine uh, that Tommy makes. And, uh, and I don't have the purple cargo liner that you asked me about. I'm sure it's the longest thing ever put on a track because that thing's ginormous. Uh, but I, I did pull out everything that we had. Of the longest ones, uh, I, I don't really, I've been scratching my head how to go about uh, making this video. So I brought out Standard Thomas, uh, and then I thought I'd just add a couple other things to it too. So before we get to, into the length of these trains, uh, we're going to go the fattest and the tallest and the skinniest and the shortest too. So um, the fattest train I would have to say is the Dr. Waruda Scorpion train. And that's the engine. And it is so fat and wide that it's crazy, crazy ridiculous. Um, so th this takes the prize for the fattest engine. Okay. Uh, right along with it is the lead car. And it's just as fat. It's just huge. And it also wins uh, widest. Because it goes like this. <laughs> so it's very wide. It's uh, This one wins. This is the widest thing you can put on a Tommy track. Uh, it beats Wing Thomas by about that much. Okay. So those are the fattest, widest engines. And then tallest. Well, this thing's got diesel 10 B with a movable pinchy. Um, this, you would think, would be the tallest train. But it actually isn't because there's a cheater train. This. <laughs> so there's your tallest. Way taller. Okay. All right. Shortest engine. How's that for short? Uh, this is the, uh, I think that's the play rail version of Rocket. Definitely the shortest engine. Or the thinnest engine. Play real bash and dash. Super thin. Tiny little guy. Tiny little guy. Beautiful though. Okay. All right. The length. So let's check it out here. So this massive thing, you would think, uh, we're, we're not going to count, um, cab roof overhangs though. We're just going to count to the back here. So, 
Although it looks really long, it's actually not re not really much longer than a Thomas. Well, that'd be, that's the short end. So, Rebecca. It's actually not much longer than Thomas. And so engines that are considered, you know, bigger, longer engines like Spencer, or Gordon. They're pretty big, but still nothing, nothing huge. We'll leave Gordon there. Streamline Thomas, and then they start getting pretty big. Persian. They're about the identical. Kenji's the same. About the same. D10. Same. They're the same. Ooh, got her by a cow catcher. Mm, got her by the cow catcher. Murdoch, what do you got going on there? Mm, about the same. Mm, about the same. Mm, identical. Ooh, by a nose. Ooh, Hank by a cow catcher. Wow. Who knew? Uh, what's this one called? This is the Rail Star. Things ginormous. Um, of all the, um, all the ones I have like this, this is by far the longest engine. Look at that. It's huge. So this is actually the longest engine. And for a Thomas, obviously it'd have to be, uh, hit toys, Hank. Okay, I'll put some of these on the layout and uh, we'll do a little run. Okay. See you at the layout.
Well, that is about it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you like that. Thanks for subscribing. Everybody have a great night.